Good morning. It's been a while. I made it back up to the cabin finally. Getting some. Well, I just got here yesterday, so I'm not really doing much of anything yet. But the weather's so nice, I had to get out and go for a little walk this morning with my coffee. I'm headed back now, and I'll start working again. So for starters, I moved. You probably remember that I was staying in a townhouse um, that I had put myself in because I needed my own space. You know, during my uh, cancer treatment, I was staying with my daughter. I stayed up here at the cabin for the majority of the season um, last year when we were being locked down. But this isn't really the kind of place that I can stay full time. There's just not enough room for me to stretch out for all of the stuff that I take on. So I moved into the townhouse. More recently, I decided that I was going to make some changes and kind of force my hand. So I moved out of the townhouse, rented it out. I sold the Rialta and bought the Sprinter van. And so I'm up here at the cabin in the Sprinter. Um, I've got a van full of stuff that I brought with me. So once I get that cleaned out, I'm going to start cleaning the interior and preparing it for what's to come. Uh, the guys at Zen Vans are working on the plans for the interior as we speak. And so far, what I've seen looks great. We've made some uh, custom changes to accommodate the chest refrigerator. I'm going to use the same one that I used in the Rialta, for instance. And, you know, I mean, that is going to take a while. That doesn't deliver until the beginning of December. So I've got a while in between now and then to get things ready. This morning, I'm assembling these shelving units. Um, I did one last night with these storage bins. So this stuff actually all came with the van when I bought it. Uh, it was a work van, and the guy that I bought it from uh, did um, AV installations, which is why there's like different HDMI cables and RCA cables. So I had him uh, leave the racks in the van thinking that I could put them to use, and I am. So I'm assembling the second one over here. They did some custom work to it, so I don't have all of the pieces, but I'm making do with what I've got. But I can use these to organize all of my junk as I put my projects together, put you know different cables and connectors and things like that in these bins, and keep it organized. It'll make it easier to find stuff. You see the mess I've got in here right now. There's the old generator from the Rialta. I guess I should sell that. Anyway, that's what I'm doing now. It's a little humid, but sure is nice out. So yeah, that's, uh, that's what I'm up to. And just like that, it's done. Look at that. I am going to be so organized. One thing you may not know about me is that I have a thing for boxes and containers. So this thing here makes me really happy, even though there's nothing in it, just because I have it and it's little boxes. I also like to buy things in pairs, um, but that's another story. There's a lot of stuff that I can't do yet, really, since I really need the interior to start laying things out. But one thing that came up, oh, pleasure way. One thing that came up is this dent up here. I don't know if you can see it, you can kind of see it. Um, that was from the previous owner. One of their ladders fell over and dented it from the inside. He hammered it back down, but it's, you know, dented. So instead of taking it into a body shop to have it fixed, I'm going to do this instead. Um, I thought I opened this already. I guess not. I'll leave it in the package to keep it clean, but I'm just going to mount this over it. That will cover up the dents, but it also gives me the ability to have some exterior lighting out here. And this thing is supposed to be super bright. Uh, it's LED and it has a rubber gasket to prevent leakage and stuff. So that's something I can do. Um, 
I have other things like I do have the Max fan already. Um, it went on sale on Amazon, so I bought it. It's normally like 360 bucks, and I think I paid 290 for it. So I have that, but I can't really put it in yet because I want the ceiling slats. There's bamboo slats that go across the top, um, and I'd like to have those here so I can see, you know, if there's any seams or anything like that. I'm gonna buy a set of roof rails and they mount through these holes, existing holes here. That's what the heat gun is for, is to help remove these. Um, again, that's one thing that I can do sooner than later, but if there's no rush. And then there's all the junk that I've got in here to take in still. Anyway, I just kind of wanted to check in and let you know that I'm still here and things are moving along, just not very quickly. A lot of it really depends on the timing for the interior since uh, that's not delivering until, oh, there goes a lizard. That's not delivering until December. I'll have to go up to Portland to pick it up. So in the meantime, um, I have plenty of time to just think about things and order parts and just get ready without feeling like I need to build it. Anyway, uh, yeah, I hope everybody's doing well and I will see you soon.